Hey, what's going on, Phoenixes? I hope you guys are having an amazing day. We're entering week three, technically only week two because we gave you a free week. But I, once again, we're gonna have another focus. As we talked about with you, and our, as your coach talked about with you, every single week, we're going to be adding something new in. We start you off just with the basics, just getting you working on your food, your mindset. We've added an exercise. We focused on your steps. So right now, you should be building a lot of momentum. You should be feeling really good. And if you're struggling with anything, just know that it's okay, but you need to be in contact with your coach. Let them know that you're struggling and they're going to dive in and help figure out what we can do as coaches to make this a little bit easier for you. Now, what I want to talk about today is goal setting. This is huge. And this is what we're going to do during week two. Now, we actually had you write down your goals during your morning routine and you should be doing this every single day but you might not really know why. And we're actually gonna have a little homework assignment, an activity at the end of this live so you guys can see what you need to do to take goal setting to the next level. Now, why is goal setting so important? Because as humans, it's so easy to allow our emotions to control our actions, but we need our goals to control our actions to be successful to reach those goals, to get 1% better every single day. Because whenever our emotions come out, if we choose to listen to them and allow them to control our actions, we forever will be a victim of circumstance. Like, let's think about it for a second. When was the last time that you got really sad, really upset? Did you show up for yourself? Did you get your workout in? Did you track your food or did you go decide to sit on the couch, skip your workout and eat something that made you feel better? That's what emotions do to you. And if you didn't do that and you actually got your workout in and you still ate healthy, well, good for you, but we're still going to do this right here. So why we want to be goal driven? Because if we have the goals in our forefront of our mind, every single time that our emotions come out, we're going to be more likely to show up for ourselves every single time. So the fact that you guys are writing your goals down every single morning, that is fantastic. This is why we have you start writing your goals off goals down during week one. So when we come into this goal setting um, training, you guys have goals that you're already setting every single day, every single week, and you're going to constantly have those already starting to be ingrained in your mind. Because know this, the more you say something, the more you hear something, the more you read something, the more you're going to actually believe it. So this is extremely important. So we're going to take goal setting to kind of a new level. We've been having you write down five goals. I challenge you to double that. I want five daily goals and five weekly goals that you're going to be writing down every single morning. So these can be towards your weight loss journey, but they can also be told towards other aspects of your life. So if you have a big goal, like let's say you want to lose 40 pounds, what are five things that you can do every single day? Like hit your water goal, hit your protein goal, get your exercise in. Now exercise would more likely be a weekly goal because you're only supposed to exercise X amount of times each week, depending on what your coach gave you. So that, that a good weekly goal would be, I'm going to hit my three workouts and two walking sessions at all this week. I'm going to track my food every single day this week. So that would be a daily goal. Hitting your um, fat intake is a daily goal. Um, another good weekly goal would be, I'm going to drink my um, kombucha, which is for your gut health, three times this week because that is my recommended time. I'm going to do this thing X amount of times this week. I'm going to show up to three trainings inside the community this week. And the reason we want to do this is because we want to redefine and make sure that you guys are doing the steps necessary to reach your goal. So these are pretty much breaking down step by step on what you need to do. So this is your homework. Those five daily goals and five weekly goals that you have for your weight loss journey and your coach is going to help you with this. They're going to send you a screen recording and show you, you know, how to do this. And they will, I, what I want you to do is I want you to download the app called Canva and I want you to take a picture of yourself and on that app and it, I, it'll be easier when you see the screen recording from your coach, but I want you to type out your five daily goals and your five weekly goals. And what you're going to do is you're going to put that over a photo of you yourself or you and your family, and you're going to save that as your screensaver. So every single time you look at your phone, which is multiple times a day, you see your goals, you see your daily and weekly goals. And what this is going to do is it's going to ingrain those goals into your mind. So you're goal driven and you show up when your emotions come out on the days that you don't want to peace, love protein. Let's freaking go.